We'll take the uh, fast freight over there. be able to take over a fast moving train. The problem is how you boot physics up into the right place because the AI is not using Simgraph. How do you get the physics so that the minute you take it over it doesn't all just go wonky? <coughs> You're on my train now. Quick driver change, get out of my train. Thank you very much. Could have set it up for me. Jeez. Well, I've got headlights on at least. <clears throat> oh, yeah, PZP. Good shout. Zero, internal, right side, PZBU, zero, internal, driver's seat, and up here, click, click. It's better. <coughs> it's not so much about the, the collision model physics, Speechlick. It's about semigraph, so essentially the train will probably just screech to a halt as the, as the brakes take over. Oh my word! Bet he was waiting a little bit. That's the um, Heigenbrook and Gamunden service. Banker's probably long gone. Yeah, Banker's long gone. It's a big old delay now. <laughs> oh, AI doesn't use Simograph. Oh my word, everything would grind to a halt. Simograph is immensely complicated. It's a total waste on the AI. Good night, Chris. Looks like there's another service coming up. Oh, it's put that double header fast in front of me. Oh no, it hasn't. We're all good. Come on, brakes. Do that thing. Just like TS, the AI cheats. Doesn't cheat quite as badly as TS. I mean, in TS1, you can set up a um, an 040 tank engine, put it ahead of um, 6,000 tons of freight, and it will go up a one-in-one -one gradient. That won't work in this. <laughs> going to be steam locus and TSW at some point I hope so give me them trucks oh, at some point I hope so 
Oh, I was still in monitoring. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now shut up. Whose idea was PZB? Eds. Blaming you for this. Your name is Ed, so therefore it's close enough. What actually happened there? What did I get wrong? Was I still in monitoring, in start program? I'm not, of course I was in start program, wasn't I? Yeah, well, remember the American brakes have got in um, quick release. They can't partially release, whereas German uh, European brakes have got partial release. <laughs> Mostly station people don't get on and off. That's interesting, Mickey. No, I wasn't aware of that. On. Takes forever to get these brakes charged up. Yeah, I think I might need a charge. That's a good show, actually. cylinder is uh, the brake here yeah, the uh, main res is uh, dumping through uh, putting a load of air into the system hey we're rolling that was it it was a main it was a, uh, a overcharge needed to clear off the brakes start program still in force I miss pizza I miss AFB Break to uh, balance the speed. Zifa. Zifa. 
I was going to do some class 101 after this, Ben, but I'm happy to put it to a vote. What does everyone want? Right, we're out of monitoring, so release the air brake and just let it speed up. Lots of votes for the 45. SD40. Not doing a class 59, Stephen Jam. Well, it's a high percentage of the people that have contributed a vote, Ed. Which I count at four. <laughs> Ferramero, uh, 45 or 101, essentially, is the, is the next one. Stephen, uh, if you're still there, can you poke up a um, a straw poll? Starting to get more people contributing votes now, and I've lost count. Oh, nicely done, Thelonious. Yeah. Couple the 101 and the 45 together, and let's have another run in a 146. No, it's either a class 101 or a class 45 on NTP next. I don't know, I could drive German routes all day these days. I love them. Speed 19 kilometers to Gemondon. How are we doing on who's winning at the moment? Don't you mean democracy? I mean, come on, get it right. Don't 
Don't worry, Mickey. If we don't do the 101 tonight, we will be doing it another time. Because oh, the 101's my favourite. <laughs> In fact, we might have to have an entire stream devoted the, to the glory of the 101. I think if I was to announce 101 on Speset Ramp, there'd be an awful lot of unjustified excitement heads. <laughs> But that's what I meant, it's if I just say 101, everyone will probably assume that I meant BR 101 and not, um, oh yeah, British Rail 101, yeah, that's what you mean. <laughs> uh, that's got to be done, actually. <laughs> there needs to be like a, um, a Brits take over the uh, main special bomb. Show me something hilarious. You've not made more poop, have you? No. <laughs> she made poop for dinner, folks. And I have to say, it tasted wonderful. Hang on a minute. Let me just pause this. <clears throat> Am I on camera? Yeah, you're on camera. Is that a problem? Yeah, my bingo wings are out. <laughs> what? <laughs> you gotta see it before it goes. This is victorious. save it or something. No. <sighs> <laughs> no, just to be clear, when I said that sorry, my wife made poop, it literally looked like poop. <laughs> it was corn dogs and it just looked like poop. Probably right, it's but they wrapped in crabs. <laughs> A load of them, yeah. They're actually really nice. 
<laughs> we're gonna have to do them again. That was really, they were really good. Make corn dog, cornbread batter, and or corn dog but, um, batter, and uh, just dip the hot dog in, chuck it in the uh, fry in the uh, fryer, and off you go. Hey, thank you for the raid there, class nine oh four. Welcome to the viewers. No, I am not trying the new peanut butter that's out, Ben. <laughs> Are you mad? Corn dog deep fried Jaffa cakes. Oh, have you tried the Jaffa nibbles? I think JP posted them about them earlier, um, a couple, a little while ago. So I, I ordered a pack. I, I went and got a pack because they look rather nice. These things. Oh my word! You're munching on some now. That's not fair, uh, JP. Share, share. Hey, no trouble at all, class 904. I was having streaming difficulties, so uh, full credit to Stephen Jam. He hunted our round and uh, we, uh, we we sorted you a raid. You know, I'm half tempted to actually just see if I can set all the scenes up that I want in this and use this. This is working perfectly well as far as I can see. I'd never thought it would do what I wanted, but it turns out you have to go into the settings and turn on the Make This Software Useful button. Oh, there's a backlog of thousands, Kyle, so... You mean except for the Powered by Elgato Gaming watermark? Yeah, I need to see if I can get rid of that. Someone Google that for me. How do I get rid of that? That's out of order. Eleven kilometres... Yeah, seriously, in order to have multiple scenes and to have any where you can add a webcam in it or anything like that, you have to go into settings and then there's an option in there for enable stream command. Because that's that's obviously the, that's on the tip of your tongue for what you're looking for to un to say, how do I add a webcam? Enable stream command. The two flow one to the other, don't they? Thankfully, the internet answers. Um... Having added that, you get a new bar along the bottom with all the stream uh, scenes in it, and it's like, ah! And then there's one where you can add a new scene and add a webcam. It's like, oh, okay, everything's there. This is good. Actually, much better than I thought it was. So, GG. There comes Law. That's the branch line, oh, uh, the diesel branch line down to the uh, industry down there. That's the Gamundan Law service sitting over there on the left. 
we're just going to wheeze through the through line. How, where's the voting standing at at the moment? And does any, has everyone added their votes? Big dog, that Vance line needs really something to drive on it, as does the entire dockyard, yes. Fifty-three to forty-seven for forty-five. Hang on, there's only seventy people watching the stream. How did we get from fifty-three and forty-seven? That's like a hundred people, isn't it? Oh, that's percentage. It's percentage. Okay, I'll shut up. <laughs> hey, rent later. Sorry, there's no um, on-screen things at the moment. But he says, 27 months. Great meeting at Ali Pali Saturday. Thanks for the pen and T-shirt. Test ran your local wagon you bought there today. They ran beautifully. Excellent. Keep up the good work. Much appreciated, rent later. 27 months. Don't worry, Mickey. The 101 will have its revenge. Again, let's get some e brakes on. No tears, though. You check, book and pen. God, that goes back a few years, doesn't it, Crucible? Blankety blank, wasn't it? Six point four to Gimundan. Uh HO gauge Suline S D sixty and an O gauge Darstad bogey tank. Oh nice. where we swing off to the right. Has anyone got any preference of what service they, um, they want me to drive then? Drive it on vacuum brake said, but I have to pull the cord on all of the BGs. Nice. I'm up for that. <laughs> Only because most people don't even realise that's there. Oh, only takes a very long time. Oh. When you say very long, and what are we talking about here? Uh, 
<coughs> no, the um, brake cylinder dump piece slick so that you can switch between air and vacuum. Or reservoir dump, whichever one it is. I can't remember. Ed will tell me. Ed will remind us all which it is. And chastise me later for forgetting. Hey, I remembered it was there. So what's the procedure, Ed? Do I leave the brakes in, out of, uh, in off, switch it over, go and change everything, and then release, and then start charging the brakes? Four point six kilometres to Gemunden. Okay, that's what I thought. Nearly there. Coming around the corner to get on done now. Oh, it would be Langham Proselton, I guess, would be our first. I don't think we've gone through there yet. So which is the best TPO that's not going to be in pitch dark then? I want something like the eve the nighttime one in, in the summer. There's Langham Proselton. Summertime morning. <clears throat> One thing that does occur to me is that via this software it hasn't got the filtering on the audio. Has it has the is the microphone coming through with any noise or is it all right? That's excellent. Maybe it's already doing that filtering then automatically. I have to have a look, see if I can get rid of the uh, the garbage on the bottom.
So we're doing the 45 TPO in the morning in the summer and we're switching it to vacuum brakes. Do I need to run it on passenger or goods timing? I would have thought passenger timing, wouldn't it? DMUs with extra coaches? Yeah. Even wagons in some case. <clears throat> it should just say powered by Moggy at the bottom, shouldn't it, Moggy? <sighs> Nearly there. Powered by Jaffa Cakes, Iron Brew, and Ice Creams. <clears throat> Take advantage of the e-brakes while we're still running at a good enough speed for them. Any two board on it, so it was a good one. It was a it was a hot one. Yeah, it did take a while, didn't it? That's the thing. You limit it to ninety kilometers now. Things tend to take a bit longer. <clears throat> Mind you, me, you know messing up the CIFA right at the beginning. Shim's train. You look at the views, Mickey. Yeah, I enjoy looking out the. Uh, I enjoy looking out the window. Hey there, Neil. How are you doing? Peter up ahead. You know what, as long as you enjoy the journey, Mickey, it doesn't really matter. Or oh, we're flying past your stations. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> 